Good afternoon. We're going to start this cook off. We've got a Boston butt with some pulled pork, and then we also have some brisket, West Texas style. So we're going to get this in the cooker, and this is the first time we're doing this cook on a Lang 48. We're going to have both meats going at the same time, and at the end of the day, we want to test the juiciness, one, uh, as well as how long the cook's going to take. Hoping that this cook takes about seven, seven hours. We already did the trim, so we trimmed both of these meats up to perfection. Took all the, you know, fat off the brisket. We're gonna go top rack, uh, top rack today. So what we're gonna do is pull this rack out. That right here. Boston butt. I like it when that thing sizzles. So we get the Boston butt on one side, and we get this brisket on the other. I don't want the Boston butt to take any smoke away from the brisket. So we got both of them on. So we've got both of these on. These guys have definitely darkened up. Brisket looks good. And we're gonna wrap it. And we're going to leave the pork shoulder in for a little bit while longer. And uh, then we'll do something with it. I may wrap it, I may not. But the brisket's ready to be wrapped. That looks beautiful. All right. Not bad. Five hours into the cook. And I'm going to say that internal temp on that brisket is probably around 180. All right. So we put the wrap on our brisket. We're going to wait on the uh, pork shoulder. But what we're also going to put in is our mac and cheese. We're going to have some smoked mac and cheese. So if you look at the chamber, it is full with our brisket, pork shoulder, and mac and cheese. We'll be done in about an hour, two hours, I would say, at the most. But we're going to shut the um, gonna shut the top of this grill and let it do its magic. As long as you cut your logs up, you keep a bed of coals, all you got to do is add additional logs and you can maintain the fire, the temperature. This uh, cooker is just incredible. I got my wood up here drying, I got it on the side drying, got my axe, splitting wood, and my firebox is just immaculate.